One of my biggest responsibilities in SunTrust Park is energy management. We probably go through about 22 million kilowatt hours of power for the entire year. Managing that is, uh, is pretty intense. Just to put it into a little bit of perspective, uh, 22 million kilowatt hours is enough power to power a small town. The whole park here is all very energy efficient. This is a LEED certified park and it's 100% LED lighting. So we're looking at a hard design cost of about a 50% less amount of power designed into this park with actual savings over 25%, which is pretty darn good. Georgia Power set up some great grids for us. I could watch my energy curve when we're getting up too high, I could shed load. And so if we're getting up to peak in design days, we could drop it down. I watch that from home. I could be in Sarasota or one of our minor league parts and I can do it all remotely. One of the things that we're really proud here that we looked for right from the beginning were electric vehicle charging or EV stations for vehicles. We have over 61 of them scattered around all over the place. Anywhere we thought we could fit them, we fit them in and we're looking at doing more. Across a battery, you'll find a number of these level two charging stations. Both is a, it's a dual port pedestal, uh, network connected. And so it's gonna give EV drivers approximately 24 to 25 miles range per hour charge. What we see is during game days and events that the average driver's here for two to three hours, and that's enough to get them on their way uh, to a, a fully charged battery. There are 200,000 additional square feet in SunTrust Park from our previous park. That is a 20-story hotel. That is a big building. We're still dropped 25% less electrical use, even with the addition of that additional 200,000 of conditioned, mind you, conditioned space. Uh, I, I don't think I could have done this without Georgia Power. They were instrumental from day one before the brick was laid. 